I had a great night so far, Judge. Well, the night doesn't have to end here. Or maybe the uh, prosecution can rest at my place tonight? I, I, I can sustain an objection for hours, if you know what I mean. We can make it even better. Wow, even better? I'm interested. How? We can go to my room. Oh, Judge, we came here to watch movie. I'm leaving. What, what do you mean? Why is it that my judge pickup lines never work? They just get completely ignored. Those were two gems. Is it because I just detonated a hobo in course? Like, is capital punishment a turnoff for women? What's up, guys? Welcome to Judge 3D, a game where, for some reason, I've been trusted to be judge, jury, and probably more often than not, executioner. And I'm not just saying that because of my twisted sense of morals or anything like that. I mean, just look at my office. The two most important things in here are executions and decorations. It's like a Ted Bundy Christmas special in here. Hi, Judge. I am your secretary. Hello, moderately attractive secretary. You're actually just in time, okay? I, I need you to look through my briefs. And I'm not talking about the ones on my desk. I will be handling your cases from now on. Not really what I was trying to get you to handle, to be perfectly honest. You see, this is the problem with cheesy pickup lines. Sometimes they just don't get it. Hold on, so hey, nice to meet you is gonna cost me 10 gemstones, but what do you want is free. <laughs> Why do I have to pay to be nice to my secretary? I I'm already paying her to be here in the first place. What do you want? Today's case is about a kid who murdered a guy who abused his mother. Oh, oh, yeah, that's really gonna put a downer on the whole mood in here. But, of course, as soon as she mentions little Billy the Butcher, then I, I don't need to open up my wallet to respond in kind. Th that's fine. You know what? Sometimes people think that you need to be suave when speaking to women. In all reality, you just need to be thrifty. Thank you. Have a great day. Um, Judge, shall we go get some coffee after some time? Uh, what? So that we can get to know each other. You see what I mean? 69% of the time, it works every time! So now, for 90 gemstones, why don't we go back to my place instead? Uh, oh, no, no, hold, hold on, hold on a second now. I'm a judge. I know better. I've seen this before. This is probably like some kind of police sting operation. I'm not paying her for anything. There is no solicitation happening in this office. We are going to be going on a first date. First. Oh, sure. That's a good idea. Cool. Then I will see you. You will see me for a completely free date. Good luck with the case. Thank you. I like her. It's very hard to find a secretary who's both attractive and wears Heelys to work. Well, I'll be damned, his name is actually Billy. Like, for me, it was just a, a coin toss between Billy or Timmy, but I was right. Uh, it looks like he's 11 years old and accused of killing a man. Now I need to write him a summons. Oh, I see. Okay, so, um... Sup, kiddo. You silly murderer. Come to court, you little piggy. That's definitely gonna get his attention. He'll take that seriously. Now we need to sign. Okay, should be easy enough. Uh, oh, um, how am I gonna work this? A little something like that. And oh yeah, it's it's a fatty, all right. Uh, this is this is not quite how I wanted it to look. I guess it's kind of vascular. And uh, we can put like one here and another over there. Yeah, I think that works. That's my signature, all right, and my stamp. Oh. <laughs> That's a very inconvenient stamp. Hey, Judge, can you use this as evidence? Evidence of what? 
that Billy's mom wasn't all that great of a mom. He's 11 years old. She got one candle on the cake. Are you kidding me? I really doubt that he beat somebody to death with an ice cream cake. You could, but uh, no. Nope. We are not looking for that. Judge, I found this at the crime scene. Okay, that is probably more relevant. I, I wasn't there, so I don't really know what went down, but it looks like of the potential evidence items, we uh, may have screwed up the identification progress. Somebody mixed up these tanks. <laughs> I'm no weaponsologist, but I'm pretty sure that's wrong. Maybe this is just a case of your potato potato, whatever you want to call it, uh, I'll take it. Finally, something useful. Good afternoon, Judge. I hope this is helpful. Again, don't really see how, uh, unless Billy beat the guy with a uh, craft collage, then um, no? No. Why would it be helpful? Hello, Judge. Is this as evidence helpful? Yeah, okay, we'll, we'll take that as well, and then I guess see how the trial plays out? Why is somebody T-posing off screen? Who's T-posing in my courtroom? I swear to God, I'm going to hold them in content. Get over Definitely. here. Definitely. Who's... Good job. Oh, they don't want to come over? Oh, I better not be you, Billy, so help me Christ. Oh, who are you now? Hi, I'm Billy's lawyer. I came to discuss the case. I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to be talking to the lawyers before a trial. How did you even get in here? <laughs> or better yet, why is there a romance meter? I'm not sure I like where this is going, but I'll hear you out. What is it that you want to discuss? Billy is just a kid. He killed that guy to protect his mother. Uh-huh. Please don't send him to jail. Oh. So, are you trying to, like, convince me with favors? Because, you know, if you wanted to sue the pants off me, you could really just ask instead. But, um... I'll think about it. Hmm, you are right. I'll think about it. You are the best judge ever. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> you, you know that it's on the up and up when the conversation is over and she books it. That kid is the devil. Huh? Little boy was only protecting his mommy. What? Can, can we maybe get some order in the court? Order, or order in my court. Okay, I don't need to play whack-a-mole, right? Or Jesus Christ. <laughs> order in my courts. While we're at it, could we also place an order for some coasters that aren't made of Fabergé? Silence. Yeah, quiet down. Your Honor, we brought you the mother of the suspect. Oh. My son was protect. Objection, Your Honor. She is a victim. It is not appropriate. Not appropriate for a victim and a witness? To, to say something, you, can, you know, there is a very strong precedent set out there that he protect, but he also attack. Therefore, I overrule in this meme case. I will allow it. My son was protecting me from that disgusting man. Please don't send my little boy to prison. I'm sorry, Your Honor. I don't know why I am here. You don't know why you're here, Billy? It's because you shot and or killed a man, or maybe hit him with a frozen cake, or, or, or with craft supplies. We're not really sure, okay? That's what we're trying to get to the bottom of. Could you maybe help us out a little bit? Remember, son, you are under oath. Yes, Your Honor. I will always tell the truth. I'm sure you will. Okay, so what happened? So, is it true that you murdered that man? Murder? Are you joking? I'm just a kid. You can still murder as a kid, you know? Could I maybe get some more coasters in here? I need to hit something else, get the frustrations out, and make these other people quiet the hell down. All the disembodied voices are concerning me. We have strong evidence to prove it. Ha ha, it's impossible. Unless you found my gun. Oh, no, 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 Billy. <laughs> no, Billy, you're, you're giving the whole farm away. Uh, this would be the evidence that we found, which, by the way, I, I don't really know how to explain how it was found. It's like we just release a bunch of people into the crime scene, they pick up what they find is interesting, they bring it back to me and then ask if I like it. It's like a police precinct full of golden retrievers. <laughs> but you, you said gun, right, Billy? You can't lie to me. Gun or gun. Oh my god, you found it. 
I hid it very well in my toy box. You're breaking my balls here, Billy. It's, it's really, really hard to, to... Oh my god, I can't execute you! Now, hear me out. I, I should let him go. Right? That would be the responsible judge thing to do. But I should also fry him like chicken because that would be the responsible entertainer thing to do. So I think we're just going to split the difference and send you to prison for life. No, I will miss my mom in prison. Yeah, well, you'll learn a whole lot more there than school, evidently. Good job, Judge. Was it? Was it really? Hey, Judge. I think you made the best decision on the last case. Well, that makes one of us, I suppose. <laughs> I like the fact that she still calls me judge. You know, I'm definitely still judging people. Oh, uh, what the hell is happening in this coffee shop? We should not be drinking what they serve here. Anyways, let's not talk about work here. Yeah, yeah, I, I agree. How about we talk about you and your name? Unless you want me to keep calling you secretary and you keep calling me judge, a little kinky, but I'm down for it. This coffee shop is my favorite. Did you like it? Oh. Oh, come on, really? So, if I want to go on the date, I have to watch an ad? Why is she such an expensive date? You know what, other than the TikTok commercials and the tweakers at the front counter, I I've been having a good time. Yeah. Your taste is great. This place is amazing. Oh, really? I'm glad that you liked it, Judge. Still can't get over the fact that she calls me Judge. Anyways, tell me about yourself, Judge. What do you like? Ooh, now might be the time to break out the gems. I like you, baby. Um, I didn't expect that at all. But to be honest, I can't say that I don't like you. Okay. You know what, that's about the bare minimum answer I would expect for a paid response. What is it that you like about me? Oh man, you're bleeding me dry here, come on. You are so hot, baby. Oh really? Hearing that from you is amazing. I find you very attractive as well. Good, I, I, that, I, I feel good about that, especially considering my delivery for these compliments is so bad. <laughs> the, the baby at the end is just cringe-inducing. Anyways, Judge, it was a great day. It was a great day. I'm glad we got to know each other better. Did we? I hope we can do something like this again after you finish your cases. I think we should too. Of course, I would love to as well. Okay, you know what, that went pretty well. I'm, I'm gonna have to work a whole lot more cases because I'm, I'm gonna need a whole lot more gemstones to go out with you again. Hi again, Judge. I'm very excited to see you. I'm excited to see you, too, even though the first time I was mean to you, it worked. We went out on a date. You asked me out. So, I mean, maybe I could save some gems and just give you one of these? You, again. Give me the case, then leave. Today's case is about a guy who robbed a bank. <sighs> robbed a bank? Okay, now we're getting somewhere. He got away with millions of dollars. Good luck. Interesting. Okay, yeah. Did the golden retriever with the label maker screw things up again? It says murder. Suspect information is John, age 31, accused of robbing a bank. But we don't really care all that much about the bank thing. It's more the killing people thing. That uh, Okay, you know what? Who am I to judge? Let's just uh, send him a subpoena. Sop, John the robber. Come to court ASAP. Bring the money as well. There's no way that works, right? W would he actually bring the money as well? <laughs> Let's just see if we can get our old signature, old John Hancock, as they would call it. I think I need to fill out all these little squiggles, so um, it's more of an Among Us character this time around, but <laughs> give it that, oh, I still can't believe that. <laughs> Where the hell did I put my gavel? Hi, I'm John's lawyer. I came to discuss about the case. Uh, yeah, court's happening upstairs in, like, two minutes. I, I just need to figure out where I put that box of coasters that I need to smack. Uh, w w what do you want? Oh, you must be that robber's filthy lawyer. Yes, 
That would be me. <laughs> yes, I am the filthy lawyer, sir. Thank you for recognizing that. Well, I will cut it short. I'm related to the robbery as well. Related as in you're John's cousin? Or related as in you were there? We can give you some cash if you let my guy go free. I'm gonna take that as the latter. It's not quite the same favors I was hoping for with the last lawyer, but, uh, yeah, you know what? I I'm listening. Hmm, interesting. How much cash are we talking about? I can give you $2,000. $2,000? Really? <laughs> Dude, this is a, a criminal murder case, not an all-inclusive Chuck E. Cheese birthday party. Haha, uh -huh. make that $10,000 or leave the office. Okay, okay. 10,000 it is. I'll see you on court. Yeah, that's better. You better get out of here. Uh, should I be concerned that there's a camera right outside my office? I, I seem to always miss that. Daniel Robert. He is the wrong guy. Okay, can we please just quiet down? You're driving me freaking crazy. Or oh, stop with this. Order in my court. Hello? Can I... Uh, why, why is my gavel lagging? Honestly, I, and to be fair, I don't really need to worry about CCTV footage. I'm, I'm pretty sure that my bailiff is a labradoodle. There we go. Silence. Hi, Your Honor. We brought you a witness. He is the security guard of the bank that was robbed. Oh. I saw that guy. Objection, Your Honor. There is no security camera footage to prove that. Are you threatening me? Are, are you implying that there is security camera footage to prove other crimes? Uh, overruled. I will allow it. I was on my night shift while I was eating my donut. I saw him. He was there. Okay, let's get this over with. I have things to do. <laughs> are we not going to talk about how the witness is wearing a baseball jersey and, and a bow tie? But <laughs> doesn't seem all that credible. Uh, I don't really feel good about you, John. I, I need you to remember you can't lie to me. Remember, John, you are under oath. Yes, Your Honor. So, uh, you really think that you didn't rob it? You are accused of robbing a bank. What do you say? I should have lots of money if I robbed it, but I don't. You don't, do you? But what if you did? Oh, okay. I admit that I did it. I should have taken the job instead of robbing the bank. Yeah, yeah, you should have. Especially because now you're not 11 years old and I, I really want to fry somebody. It's kind of weird that the judge has to pay for capital punishment, but I guess good entertainment doesn't come free. Except for this video. You, you should leave a like on this video. That's your payment. Gentlemen, gentlemen, I've got a bit of a hot date to get to, so if you could all just line up, we're going to have a justice speed round. <laughs> we'll get to the bottom of... Who stole my bailiff's shoulders? Dude looks like a hot dog wiener in camo. <laughs> Entering restricted area, crime narrative stole the purse of an old lady. Life in prison. Go to prison. Next, assault, crime narrative, punched a shoplifter in the face. Arrest. Damn criminal, serve your time. Lots of time. Next, <laughs> reckless driving, crime narrative, passed the speed limit by two miles per hour per second, trying to go to the hospital. Miles per hour per second? What kind of, uh, oh. I could take a bribe of 500 gems. That's a whole lot of compliments or one very creative way of killing people. Yeah, you know what? I don't really recognize your metric of movement. Mile per hour per second could be a little bit, could be a lot, not sure. Uh, I'm not too worried about letting the criminal go. I'm. Uh, more so questioning whether watching this was worth the gems. What the hell am I looking at? <laughs> okay, you know what? That's not the question that I should be asking right now. What we need to know is which execution should be purchased. We can go with immolation, detonation, gun, what I would assume is poison, or hanging. And I probably want to save some money for compliments, so let's just go with... Detonation. I haven't seen that before. Hey, Judge. 
You are on fire these days. No, actually, I, I, I paid for the, the detonation, not the immolation. You could call me the bomb, though. I'd appreciate that, too. I have been tracking your cases. I love your works. I, will, I, I appreciate that. You better not be coming for my job, though. Thank you. Keep tracking them. Anyways, here is your today's case. Yeah, what do we got on the docket? It is about a homeless person attacking another person. Okay, a bit of a hobo brawl. I know that you will make a good judgment. I already know what the outcome is going to be. Guilty. Sentenced to detonation. By the way, I'm still waiting for you to invite me to a new date. Yeah, I'll, I'll get to that as soon as I can. I don't know if I should necessarily do that after blowing up the hobo, though. Second thought, it sounds a little messy. <laughs> uh, oh, we got gems to spare, though. Oh, where do you want to go, sweetie? Anyways, great. I will be waiting for you. The delivery on the pet names is rough. Good luck. He attacked him without any reason. He is guilty. Just turn the court. I want to get paid immediately. <laughs> you can't just say that with him right there. I know he probably can't hear you because it's always so freaking loud in here. Silence! There we go. Silence! Silence. Silence. There we go. Hi, Your Honor. Hi. We brought you a witness. Who? He is the man who got attacked without any reason. So he's not murdered. Hello, Your Honor. Let me tell you my side of the story. I don't even know this guy. I was just minding my own business. He just came out of nowhere and attacked me without any reason. Thank you, Your Honor. That was all. No objection? First of all, I'm sorry for hitting him. Okay, so you did hit him. You're admitting to that, but we don't know why. And I'm sorry for wasting your time, Your Honor. Uh, what? What are you talking about? My life is a living hell, Your Honor. I have no money, house, and anyone I can call a friend. Oh. Please help me. Jail would be best place for me to live. Oh, that's cute. You think you're getting jail? I attacked that guy on purpose, so that you could put me in jail. Oh no, you clearly don't know the law around these parts. I'm sure you found my pipe as evidence on the crime scene. Yeah, we found the pipe. That's not what you should be worried about, though. Oh, that's very good. I'm so lucky that you found that. Uh-huh. Yeah, okay, well, um, let's just do what he wants and send him to... Oops! Bailiff, I accidentally pressed the wrong button! Oh! <laughs> Wait, wh why is it so big? I hit him with a, a stick of dynamite the size of a garbage can! Here we go... This movie is so good. What movie? The, the TV was off. We're not watching anything except for ads. I, I, I still feel like this is hinging on illegal. You shouldn't be able to date me in exchange for advertising. It's practically money. I'm watching you and it's better. Oh, Judge, you are so fast. Wow. I have been known to be rather quick witted at times. I had a great night so far, Judge. Well, the night doesn't have to end here. Maybe the uh, prosecution can rest at my place tonight? I, I, I can sustain an objection for hours, if you know what I mean. We can make it even better. Wow, even better? I'm interested. How? We can go to my room. Oh, Judge, we came here to watch movie. I'm leaving. What, what do you mean? Why is it that my judge pickup lines never work? They just get completely ignored. Those were two gems. Is it because I just detonated a hobo in course? Like, is capital punishment a turnoff for women? I need to know these things. Can I use your shower before I leave? Ooh, I don't think you're going to like this. Yes, actually, let's shower together. What? Judge, get over yourself. It never works. Why did I just spend all those gems? See you later. I could have bought a gun to shoot people with. <laughs> oh, I'm so mad. <laughs> all right, you know what? I think that's going to be it for this episode of Judge 3D, guys. I have no idea how far this goes, like how many different kinds of court cases there are or how many other types of dates there are, if we can actually get somewhere with the secretary. If you can, if you guys want to see more, as always, be sure to leave a like in this video, leave a comment letting me know, and maybe I'll return to dish out some more justice soon.
But thanks so much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.